It's not very many people really know, but the Great Lakes has thousands of shipwrecks. In Wisconsin, for sure, we know we have 750 um, historic shipwreck losses. My name is Caitlin Zant, and I'm a maritime archaeologist with the Wisconsin Historical Society. I would say the main goal of what we do in maritime archaeology is to preserve our maritime history and also the history of the United States in general. The ships are quite sturdy, but they've also been underwater for up to 100, 150 years. Our shipwrecks don't disappear over time like they do in the oceans. The fresh water that's very cold actually does a really good job at preserving these shipwrecks. One of the really great things about Lake Michigan that makes it really unique is the fact that you do have fresh, clear water. You can see many times, especially on deep wrecks, 100 to 150 feet. When you are down there looking at a shipwreck, you start to think of all the sailors that sailed on it, or if it was a passenger ship, the passengers that happened to be on it. So you can still find pieces of clothing in certain areas, buttons, shoes, um, and so that really gives insight to the lives of these sailors. There's definitely a, a little bit of a thrill of discovery. Um, when we go down on a ship, even on a ship that we know, we think we know what it is, there's still always that little um, sense of excitement that you're gonna find something that no one else has seen before.